we shall have. Hang on, it's time up here, bring you some more Warcraft 3 action. Playing today, spawning in the South Pier 15th Sway, playing as Night Elf, going for the Demon Hunter first. Bunch more creeping over here. Playing some face in the north, we have Yanga playing also as Night Elf, also going for the Demon Hunter. Bunch more creeping out, a different camp though. Going for the big consumable over here, got the Wand of Mana stealing. Your building is, map is Northern Isles, and this one from Dreamhack Asia. Uh, close qualifiers, the latest season of Dreamhack Asia. Kind of confusing though, because we don't have any observers, unfortunately. So I have to hear a lot of clicks from 15th way, but I stand ready. That's how it goes sometimes. Okay, tick underway. Our warriors Both have players, basically the identical timing. I stand ready. Sentry wards over here. Sleepers of agility, that's pretty nice. Hero, we're going to see second from these two players. Maybe some uh, Naga Sea Witch. I stand ready. Perhaps some Keeper of the Grove. We'll have to wait and see. Rejuvenation Potion activated there. Coming in and creeping the expansion position. We have a Wisp. Your building is so might have scouted this. Oh, he's got another Wisp coming in. Do some more scouting. Look to uh, switch the focus file onto the Wisp, and down it goes. Doesn't even detonate. Bit of extra experience there for 15 Sway. Same camp being done by Yaga. One Archer down, though. Compared to his opponent. In fact, uh... Two archers down now, another one joining in the mix. Interesting. So uh, slightly faster to three, I believe, but slightly lower experience now. Four arches versus five. Source by the Your shop, picks up the boots. Complete. Both players, in fact, got the boots now. <laughs> and there go the mana burn wars. Upgrade finished. No more mana for Younger's Demon I Hunter, and me. it is indeed going to be Naga Sea Witch for. 15 sway. We go for the shop camp after completing that. Back the other way, we've got the keeper. Okay. Our sacred grove is being so that's the first major split in tactics. Tavern hero versus the keeper. Keeper can scale pretty well in those uh, bear wars with the thorns aura. Research finished. I can see which good impacts hero right now. Can get some pretty nasty damage going. Bit of harass on the wisps. Pretty annoying to deal with, honestly. I come in for the cancel on the laws as well. Bring back the rest of the army now. Well, it looks like this one is going to get cancelled. Going for another wisp kill or two. The rest of the night off army is coming, so... Doesn't have the tally staff, might have to town portal out of this one. Cycling in to the gold mine. Here we go, blocking. Cold arrow, blocking, blocking, blocking. Cold arrow. And town portal. Nicely done there by 15 sway. Maybe a touch greedy from Younger, not picking up the tally staff to get away from that, but. Fair enough. He did get a good amount of harass done. Oh, wow. Wow, Ancient of Winds back the other way. Hippo Riders? Interesting. Could be. Our warriors have engaged the enemy. It's 
Still a good number of archers with 15 sway to fight against them if that is the case. Oh, gets off on the worst end of the mana burn, doesn't get his one off. Our warriors have engaged the enemy. No more mana for 15 sways, Demon Hunter. Oh boy, a bit of a creep jack. Tangle, these archers are in some big trouble, outnumbered quite badly. I can see which trying to run some defense, but slow on this archer now, then Tangle on the Naga. Doesn't last long, only level one. Demon Hunter coming in. Looking for a bit of blocking. Going to sacrifice an archer complete. to make sure this Naga see which gets away safely. Two archers, in fact. Another Demon Hunter coming in from the rear. And this is where, you know, slowing down those tech structures starting to hurt. 15 sway. A little bit late with the dryer production. And I'm uh, feeling quite weak because of that. Oh boy, Demon Hunter. Stuffed out to safety. Oh, saves the archer last second. Good mana burn. Have a, a little bit of moon juice left, but not a huge amount. Going to be tough to defend, but oh, does have the orb of venom. On his demon hunter now, that's ah, the great an extra weapon. Ward scouting that out. Got a few talons coming through. But are we going to see the hippo riders? That's what I'm most curious about. Research finished. Picks up Naga Sea Witch himself. The sleeper has awakened. Bears coming through now. Research finished. Got upgrades on the archers. Our warriors have engaged. Nice item there though. Scourge Bone Chime's gonna work nicely on those bears. Counteract the damage from the Thorns Aura. Did that get nerfed as well? No, it's still the same level of healing from the Vampora. Okay, looks like Younger poised for a fight. Very close to 50 food, so ready for some action. 15 sway quite far off 50 himself. So he's at a bit of a weak point. Got the talons with the master training. So the cyclone can be there. Gonna have to sacrifice a moon well. Only one bear in the mix currently. Oh, cyclone. Research finished. Okay. Bears with the master the training. The enemy. Four talents, so it doesn't have a huge amount of cyclone. Okay, the turnaround. Damage onto the Demon Hunter. Oh, he's got the Ancient of War coming in. Trying to level the playing field. Here comes his Demon Hunter in from the rear. Our warriors have engaged the enemy. Anti magic shell. The sleeper has awakened. Trying to dodge that wisp, looking for the detonate. Does so successfully. Got a expansion coming up, but 15 sway. Finds an opportunity in amongst all this to come up here and go for the cancel on that. Nicely done. Our sacred grove Our is being the enemy. Got a few more bears coming through in production as well. Oh, well timed mana burnt. Now they're going to war. Very far though, dropping the Demon Hunter's armor, making him <laughs> quite susceptible to the focus fire. Gotta run back with the, the rest of the army. Couple bears in the mix now. Losing Moonwell after Moonwell though. 15 sway now supply stuck trying to prevent this one from going down but the wisps can't get there for the repairs coming in for some detonate minor detonate action try getting there really early taking a good chunk of damage the rest of the army wrapping the around has awakened younger restarting the expansion now but deciding to pull back interesting call he's got the hunters all coming through now for the upgrades and Ultra Vision is going to be the first one. 
makes sense. We are at night time currently. Raw on Fifteen Sway's troops and finding an opportunity here to pick off an archer or two. As Younger tries to go for a touch of creeping. Ooh, a little bit late on the mana bird. Fifteen Sway. He hasn't gone for the dead night, getting rid of this raw. Big damage off to the Naga Sea, which has to town portal out. How much damage can he do in the meantime? Not a huge amount. One archer, one talent, I think that was. Time for a healing ward. Did have a lot of fairy fire on these bears. Which is going to reveal those bears... Too younger, so he knows exactly where 15 Sway is heading. Up to the red camp, but it looks like he's going to go for the red camp himself, so. No creep jacks. Ah, the great outdoors. Just have the Ancient of War up here, trying to drag the creeps into it so I can soak the damage. Taking the uh, range damage at least for the moment. Your building is complete. Insight. Mm. All right. The sleeper More mana on the beers, I guess. More mana on the dryads could be kind of helpful for the dispels. Not really a huge asset on its own heroes, though. The expansion and tangling. Our warriors Got a few have fairy dragons in the mix now. No great so on the archers at all. Interesting. The sleeper has awakened. Okay, you got a whole bunch of illusions. <laughs> with the roar. Let's get this fight started. Younger with a 10 food lead. He's at the front going down fast. A lot of focus fire damage. Getting magic shell on the demon hunter out the back now, getting up close and personal on the heroes. The air front line though not lasting for much longer. Coming in for the detonate. Oh, oh the demon hunter goes down! Wow, what happened there? And on the back of that fight starting to go quite nicely for 15 sweet. There's one I can see which starting to get in a little bit of trouble. Running away. Not even stopping by the shop. Oh, now you see which coming back in. There goes the keeper. Oh my god. What about the Nagasee Witch next? No, the dried's all going down. No more slow poison. Uh oh, Nagasee Witch in trouble back the other way. Demon Hunter, maybe you got the stuff ready. Who stuff's on cooldown? Stuff out of beer not too long ago, okay. Looks like Demon Hunter stuff was ready to rumble. Either way, uh, Younger still comes out of that fight. Ten food ahead. It's got the expansion running, so probably in a good position, all things considered. Shredder picked up by 15 Sway. Interesting. Very low on lumber. Guess he never rebuilt uh, any of those wisps that he bought him for the detonate and for the repairs uh, in that fight at his base, so. Very, very low on lumber. Involve potion on the Naga Sea Witch. Interesting. You know, I don't think we saw any of those fairy dragons go into mana flare form, so just using them for damage did receive a damage nerf. Remember the other patch and a mana flare buff, so worse in this role than they used to be. This is a little bit lacking in the range damage though to counter them. 
Good dodge on the Dimnate there with the Demon Hunter. Very nicely done. There's the fear. Drop down, good fork lightning, might as well make use of it since you got the pipe of insight. Spam those forks. Hunter up in the air. Not much cyclone left on those dots. Oh, going hunting for the Naga Sea, which is close to the shop though. With the rejuve running. Gotta run out to safety for the moment. Hunter coming back into the mix. Good mana burn. In the air once again. Heal scroll. Oh, oh that's pretty good. pretty good value out of that heal scroll. Now focusing down the bear. Staff down. Oh, mountain giants coming Our through now. They're gonna be a little bit more resistant. The cyclone. To the piercing damage as well. Not that there's a huge amount of piercing damage with all the archers just about dead now. More on the fairy dragons, I suppose. Level 5 Demon Hunter, he's a beefy boy, he's got the Envol Potion as well. Activates now. Breaks free of the surrounds. But still getting cyclones. Maybe like two more cyclones this left on these finished. talents. Not many of them with enough mana. I can see which in some trouble getting chased down. Demon Hunter's got the boots and the Orb of Venom. So quite a lot of Moonwell mana remaining. Another shop as well. Just constantly units up in the air. Come a couple dead nades. Looking to get rid of the last of the mana from the talents. And there we go. Pretty much completely dry now. Oh boy, Demon Hunter. Risky run back. It's okay. Get those two moon wells down the bottom. Back to night time. Into magic shower. Oh, that was a nasty mana burn. Mission Giants out the back. Doing some taunts, soaking some damage, doing a couple hits on the heroes. And has 15 sway managed to stabilize? Pumping slightly above 50 now, those mountain giants. Seven food each, I believe. Very, very expensive. Our gold mine is running low. Young is still close to 10 food a hit, however. Regening that mana on those talons quite nicely at this stage. Stopping by the shop. Clarity. The sleeper has More talents. Awakened. Keep them up from one wind, though. Would be better to split them across both of them. The great outdoors. Okay, anti magic shell, healing potion. Might have been more starting up. Split on the army here for younger. Okay, uh, Mountain Giant switching outdoors. over to, to the clubs gives them the siege damage, which is Research quite effective finished. against the talents with the unarmored. So it's an interesting transition. Maybe he wants to switch over to bashing the dots with those. You see which instantly in some deep trouble. There's no survivability items. Having to run out. Looks likely to go down to the demon hunter back there. But oh boy, forgot about his own keep of the grove. Down he goes. Looks like it's going to be hero focus now for younger going the after the demon hunter again. Bears and mountain again. giants chasing down the talents. Demon hunter just running around, <laughs> playing evasively. 
One thing the mountain giants can also do is bash the hell out of an expansion. 370 gold left, so 15 sway. Looks like he's going to rely on walking his tree across to the expansion position shortly. Oh boy. Oh. oh, he's got the rejuve running. And the heal potion active. Talon's taking the hammering from those mountain giants with the war clubs. War clubs have run out though. He's going to have to pick up some more trees. And back on that siege damage. Or maybe not. Gold mine has oh collapsed. boy, finds opportunity, goes after the Naga Sea Witch. Nope, and Bolt Potion activated level 6 on the Demon Hunter. The extra bit of health from that, able to keep him alive. And now the Dryads come up with the Slow Poison, able to run away from the opposing Demon Hunter quite effectively there. That's incredible. And now 15 Sway, 10 food ahead. He's what, like, nearly 5k gold behind? Somehow. <laughs> Fighting these fights so effectively, he's back in the game. Well, he's in the lead, in fact, quite comfortably in the lead. And this expansion won't last long. All clubs back up. Gonna smack through the base. All our air units at the moment. Oh, but there's the metamorphosis. And they, <laughs> they can do some nasty AoE damage to those air units. Bring it back onto the expansion. Younger in some big trouble. Come back in. Look at how quickly that expansion went down though. Metamorphosis working nicely against the fairies. Not lasting long. A couple drives in the mix. There go all the fairy dragons. Just has to run away until the durations run out. Picks up a heal scroll. There we go. Back to regular form on his demon hunter. And here comes the hero focus. Both directions though. Some nasty amount of damage coming in for 15th weight. Our warriors have engaged the enemy. Chasing him down. Coming in from the other side with the Keeper, the Entangle perhaps? There it is, a little bit slow. Very quick on the Dispel as well. Maybe that's what he's trying to do, trying to slow Our it down have engaged the to enemy. delay the Dispel. Bit of cat and mouse games. Your building is complete. Okay, hero focus onto the demon hunter again. Very quick on the dispel. Not much juice left in these moon wells. And down he goes. Uh oh. This thing's starting to fall apart here for 15 sway. Now the Naga Sea Witch just came out of the altar. Got to go down herself. Hero is actually very low for younger as well. Uprooting the tree is going to try to get them involved in the fight. There we go, both his heroes are down. Can he get the revenge kill on the Demon Hunter? Oh, both the Dryads falling. Mountain Giants can act as a bit of a blocker in the base. Yes, Demon Hunter goes down back the other way. To the Treant, I believe. Expansion ready for some uh, Wisps. Here they come. Gonna start the mining again. Tree of Eternity walking its way across here, so both players lacking gold at the moment. Stops by the shop, cashes in a few items. Does it mean an altar revive? Our yes, altar. Demon Hunter coming back this way. And doesn't really have any defenses against these fairies at the moment. Looks like he's going to split off his army though, go for the kill on the Tree of Eternity. I can see which are very low. Slowly chipping away at the mountain giant. Have engaged the enemy. Here we go, going after Younger's Tree of Eternity. 
gonna go with a little bit of resources there to do a tiny bit of repairs, but now he's run out of gold once again. Looking for a dead net, not entirely sure what that was about. Gold arrow looking for the kill on the shredder. Uprooting now. Going across to heavy instead of fortified armor. Hopping against the mountain giants, but not enough. And down goes his base. There's no means of harvesting any gold anymore. Our warriors have engaged the enemy. 15 sway, getting it, getting it done here. Maybe it was a slight mistake from Younger chasing down that mountain giant with the rest of his army down here. Might have got the kill, but might have also cost him all of his gold. Demon Hunter's about to come back. I'm not sure what level he is. If he's close to six, though, that could switch things up a bit. With a bit more experience. At last, we shall have revenge. Oh, what? Buyback. 15 sway with the buyback. Our oh, we can see 5.5 on the Demon Hunter. We can see it up on the top right. Okay, a bit of damage onto the opposing heroes. Keep a very low on mana, so not much of a threat. Demon Hunter gonna run back. Regen some mana from these moon wells. We'll lose one mountain giant here to the fourth lightning. Here we go. Monster mana burn, no more mana. For the enemy demon hunter. Here we go, Metamorphosis, ah, the and the turnaround, outdoors. and with that, Younger throws in the towel, understandable here, no way of getting any more gold, 15 Sway cuts this one out, well very well played by 15 Sway in the fights, you know, picking off a few heroes here or there, Younger maybe getting a tiny bit sloppy when chasing in, going balls to the wall for his opponents. Heroes and uh, forgetting about his own, costing him a couple. And uh, 15 Sway grinding this one on and out. You know, he's like close to 5k gold behind, but somehow ended up winning these fights with the uh, superior army composition. It just looks like those fairies with a slight damage nerf not nearly as effective as they used to be. Well, anyway, guys, thanks for tuning in to some more Warcraft 3 action. Until next time, goodbye and good luck.